Today is day four of our trip to Antarctica. We were at Wilhelmina Bay this morning, mesmerized by the spectacular icebergs, sailing through the broken ice and get close to the glaciers. In the afternoon, we had a Saudia cruise and we could see how exposed Trinity Island and Spurg Island were. Spurg Island is an island lying off the western extremity of Trinity Island in the Palmer Archipelago of Antarctica. The motion from the Drake Passage just came right in, but fortunately, it was still calm enough to do a Saudia cruise expert, which was a highlight of our trip. The sea was rough, and we sailed through the narrow passages and caves we didn't expect to see in Antarctica. They are really solid rock, but if you have the slightest movement, it will break off. Yeah. So once you have this hole, it's easy for the sea to just come and erode it yeah. more, more easily. I guess in another hundred years or so, this will this exactly. still happen. Exactly, this will be clean too. Yeah. And going No? No. Are we going through? Going through. Going through. You want to go inside? I have a lot of different things. You have the Jehalas with all the ice and all the mountains. You have volcanic islands. You have those kind of really weird landscape. You see it's small algae that can develop on the rocks. So when you have the, the deep swell from the sea that's uh, coming all the way. Three pillars arch just over there on both sides. That is really impressive. Wow, that's good. There were some icebergs floating around and solitary penguins and birds were occasionally sighted on the rocks. With that, we sailed up the Brentfield Strait at night 
covering a distance to get to the Antarctic Sound to make a landing the next day at Brown Bluff. We spent time with the Adelie and the Jango penguins. of penguins walk along the beach to the preferred location to get into the water away from areas where leopard seals may be hiding. Some of us walk along the beach to observe the penguins swimming and jumping into the sea. Bluff is home for over 20,000 breeding pairs of Adelie penguins as well as a small colony of Jantu penguins. You can have exactly two different species. They are completely different. They are from the same uh, group, the people say this. But this is more for one area, this can be in one area. And this one is more abundant in the Atlantic Peninsula. And this one in the coldest part of the
After Brown Bluff, our ship took about an hour and got into the Weddell Sea. There are plenty of icebergs in this area, and over there, the captain diverted to the west and back to the Antarctic Sound to see the tabula ice. We then crossed Branfield Strait again, took the more challenging navigation of the English Passage and headed across to the Drake Passage towards Ushuaia. This is the story of our voyage of La Liria, our cruise. The total distance we traveled was 2,210 nautical miles from Ushuaia then back to Ushuaia. We hope you enjoy our Antarctic voyage and the stunning footage we took. I've added the link to the playlist of Antarctica where you'll find all the videos about our Antarctica trip. In the next video, we'll talk about how we spend our time on our expedition cruise Lally Rio. See you soon.